Good evening. My name is Saba. Can I meet you, please? Yeah, I'm Olua Rotimi Daniel. I'd like to ask you if you would like to date or marry an amputee. <laughs> uh, actually, it depends on the love, actually. It depends on the love. Let me just say, because we are not all perfect. So, and um, I have my own internal disease in myself, which I don't, which I won't be able to share outside. So, I can, I can marry whoever I love, as far as the love is actually connected. So, there's no big deal in that. Thank you for your honest answer. Yeah, yo. And by the way, I'm an amputee. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Like was I don't have one leg. You don't have one leg? Yes. Uh, okay, fine. I, I believe that because I, I do see some videos like legs are made and things like that. So, so I, can you guess which leg I'm missing? Which leg you are missing? Yes. That should be the right leg. It's the left. <laughs> left. Okay. <laughs> Thank you for your time. Uh, All right. Would you like to marry or date an amputee? No. Not someone that doesn't have one leg or one arm? No. Why? I don't know. There are people for them actually, but it's just my choice. I understand I that. You'll find love that they're looking for. Thank you for your honesty. So looking at me now, would you allow your brother or your relative to marry me or date me at least? Why not? Because I don't have one leg. No! <laughs> I do not. No, no, you're a fine girl now. Even if it's his choice, actually, it does, it's, not, it's not up to me to decide for him. Thank you so much. Oh, please, can you guess which leg I don't have? Looking at me. You can look at me. Can you guess? I can't guess. <laughs> Just try. I can't. Probably your left. Yes, you're right. <laughs> Thank you for your time. You're welcome. Can you date or marry somebody who doesn't have one hand or one leg? <laughs> Who <laughs> doesn't? <laughs> Actually, I can't. I can't. To be sincere with you, I can't. Because it's going to be a problem for me. You understand? It's going to be a huge problem for me. So I don't think I will. Okay. Thank you. So looking at me now, can you date me or marry me? You are not physically challenged. You are okay. So I can date you. You are okay. So. Are you sure? Look at me very well, though. Uh, <laughs> I can, I can. You are okay to me. I can. Because I don't have one leg. No, no, you have. <laughs> I don't. <laughs> <laughs> well, um, uh, apologies, sir. You know, uh, the reason I said that is that, you know, it will hinder my growth, she understand. Whereby I have to focus on how to take care of that person, she understand. What if the person can take care of herself? Still, there will be challenges, she understand. Challenges like. <laughs> in this case, no, she has In this case, in this case. <laughs> to be honest, I said I, I can't, I can't, I can't because there will be challenges, you understand. And uh, the challenge it doesn't it doesn't limit to uh, financial aspect alone, she understand. You know, other aspects of the marital uh, stuff, she understand. Uh, I don't think I will be able to cope. That. Thank you for your honesty. All right, bye. Please, can you date or marry an amputee? Can I date or marry an amputee? Wow. You asked for my honest opinion. Yes. Well, as it stands with um, the experience I, I have and the things I've seen, I'm not sure I can. But then if the situation warrants, and um, I'm, I'm someone that gives in to reality a lot, so I might if the situation warrants. But if it does not, I'm not sure. Okay, so looking at me now, can you date me or marry me? Well, <laughs> That's a very, very personal and sensitive question. So I'm not sure I have a direct answer to that, sincerely. I'd like to tell you I'm an amputee. Wow. Yes. So can you guess which limb I'm missing? Which limb? Yes. Which uh, I can't. I mean, from the physical appearance, I'm not sure I can. Okay. So I'm, I don't have the left leg. So thank you for your So I'd like to ask you, can you date or marry somebody that does not have one leg or one hand? Well, it depends, yeah. And it depends on what? We might be together before the physical stuff, so it doesn't matter. Okay, so what if you were not together before? I can. You can? I can. 
that's, that's really nice. I feel like they deserve to be loved also. Like they need love. Mm -hmm. I don't have one leg. You don't have one leg? Yes, I only have one leg actually. So? Can you tell? No. So can you guess which one I have? Which one is not real? This one is real, this one is real. Yeah, you're right. <laughs> Thank you. So can you date or marry somebody that has only one hand or only one leg? Uh, not really. <laughs> Why? <laughs> because of the nature of the kind of things I'm into, like research, into, okay, like research, I'm into academics too. So I want someone that will be able to take care of the home when I'm not around. Okay, so you mean um, those people who cannot go to school? It's not as if they can't go to school. But I need, you need, you need a lot of commitment. You need to commit so much into their hands to take care of the family. And most of them, they will not be able to do that. So and if you are not kind of person that could assist, so there's going to be impasse somewhere. It's we actually affect the family. That's actually a very good reason. Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay, so um, looking at me, can you date me or marry me? And of course. Why? So it depends on if your character is okay and like the human relation too is okay. No problem. But I do. I only have one leg. <laughs> Are you sure? I'm, I'm serious. <laughs> I can't do what I'm saying. So it it, it is not really. It's what you are saying. <laughs> like it's an irony. It's so. not an irony. Uh, this leg is fake. Uh, I'm serious. So can you still date me, knowing that? Yeah, of course. It depends. Like. <laughs> Yes, if you can do some call in the house, like taking care of the children when the husband is not around, why not? Thank you. You're welcome. <laughs>